now is our power on the subcommittee. We just can get round to the grid. We'll try and fix the issue on the grid. Okay, Kimmy, we go to the garage and try and fix the problem. We go to the garage and try and fix the problem. Ferrari are going to have to do a lot of overtaking. Kimi Raikkonen, due to start on the front row, will now start from the pit lane. He has a turbo issue. If he can get going, Martin Brundle, that will be a massive relief. But just what can the Scuderia do now to salvage their season? And it's lights out, and away we go. Ricardo gets away well from the back, so does Magnussen too. But it's Hamilton in the lead, and Ricardo slips behind his teammate Verstappen. Bottas now comes wheel to wheel with the Rebels going into turn one. Hamilton leads from Verstappen. Bottas swooping round the outside has had a very good start from Daniel Ricardo and Fernando Alonso making up places too. The Rebel and the Mercedes are tangling and trying to squeeze past. Bottas is just blocked out by Verstappen, but now almost going into the back of the Dutchman on the run down to turn. Turn four, Hamilton then leads, Verstappen on the inside, then comes Bottas, Ricardo Alonso on the inside, there, Van Dorn I should say on the inside of Esteban Ocon, great move from the McLaren. So here's the start, Hamilton out in front, Bottas makes an early call Martin to switch around to the outside. Yeah, you've got some nice clear air out there, both Williams having good starts too. And there it goes, so the outside of turn one quickly becomes the inside of turn two job done and it was the two force Indias actually squeezing each other and running into the Williams. On board with Max Verstappen and uh, down towards turn one we go Verstappen on the inside of Hamilton and with DRS it's the lead of the race for Max Verstappen. Lewis Hamilton's lead has gone here on lap four. He was gaining, he was gaining Verstappen. Hamilton just couldn't hold him off. That's how we do it. Well done, mate. Right, let's clear the DRS. Think about your tyres now. Valtteri Bottas under pressure from Daniel Ricciardo. Ricciardo now making a real fist of it. Round the outside, sticking to the Mercedes. He's got the inside line at turn two. Bottas is forced out a little bit wide, else they wouldn't make contact. Now Bottas has the inside line as they swoop down the hill and just manages to stay out in front. But for how much longer? Because Daniel Ricciardo down the inside at turn four makes another one of his trademark moves that we have seen time and time again this season. Esteban Ocon and Carlos Sainz tangling into turn one. Ocon had just got ahead and then got clipped by the Spaniard. Uh, look at this, Vettel, I think Vettel will just launch this up the inside. Well, that's exactly what he's trying to do. Inside at turn four and Valtteri Bottas cuts him off very nicely indeed. Hamilton's just set the fastest lap of the race on the soft compound tyre, which they're now putting on Valtteri Bottas's Mercedes as well. Vettel ahead of Bottas after the round of pit stops. You just saw the Ferrari uh, coming through. Engine problem. No engine, no engine. Understood nothing obvious from the data. Oh, dear. Well, Science is obviously not feeling enough power at the moment. I wonder, is this Carlos Science's race done? No, no engine. No Hamilton doing personal best now as well, for good measure, in second place, 34-4. Ricardo weaving a bit. You're allowed to do that oh, as Vettel goes touched. down the inside. Oh, Ricardo they... tries to cover him off. Sebastian Vettel spied the gap. Ricardo, right at the last moment, reacted to it. and you can light the candles in just a few moments time because Max Verstappen rounds the final turn for the second time in Formula One and the first time as a 20 year old now, Max Verstappen wins the Grand Prix and takes the Malaysia Grand Prix for Red Bull. Hold on, mate. That was absolutely on merit, on merit. Flawless drive. And uh, happy birthday, mate. <laughs> I enjoyed that one. <laughs>
That is why. That's Vettel. why Sebastian Vettel backed off. He's what? coming home here, Martin, with one wheel on the, the back rear of his suspension's car. Suspension's broken, and, yeah. and the wheels. How bizarre! Is that possible? Stroll is not looking where he's going. He completely shunted into my car. I mean, seriously. Now let's have a little look. This this is after the race has finished. We're on the slowdown lap. Oh. My Vettel just ran right into the side of me. An awful lot of stories, though, out of today's race. Red Bull came good. They had the pace. Hamilton extends his championship lead, but can Mercedes uh, keep ahead of Ferrari as we head to Japan? And how costly will that incident with Lance Stroll prove to be for Sebastian Vettel? Uh, for now, though, smiles on the faces of Verstappen, Hamilton and Ricciardo.